What's going on, guys? Scully wants to have a chat with you. No, no, not today. So if you notice, you might be a different spot today. You might feel a bit taller. Oh, how's the weather up there, by the way? <laughs> Pretty lame joke. Okay, yeah. we'll almost hit him. But yeah, so I decided to put my um, camera mounted on the top of the helmet. I've seen a lot of vloggers do it, and I like the picture. I didn't know how to look on my helmet because I have a I have a showy and everyone does it with like shark and stuff like that. Uh, it's got a big vent on the top of it so I had to like work around that so. Um, but yeah I got it to work and been testing for a couple of days and see how it goes and it looks pretty cool. I know I can do this instead. So yeah I'm away to work today just thought whatever I'd catch on camera I'd catch on camera. Got a ride day coming up with a bunch of vloggers this Saturday, so it should be good. Heading, uh, we're not change of plans to this Saturday, so we're either going south or north. One of them, I think we'll probably go south. But yeah, it should be good to meet up with the blokes again, go for a ride. Mainly to check out $30 refills, new re new wheels. <laughs> yeah, he's really deserves that bike. Cop too long on that CDR 250. <laughs> and he always cop shit for me. <laughs> but yeah, so should be good. So make a video out of it as well. The other night I uh, raced the body big done up car, which is funny as, kind of blew him away, with a wheelie, <laughs> I had time to wheelie and beat him, so yeah, he was a, what car was it, it was a Nissan, I think it was a 200 SX, or ZX, one of them, yeah, he acting all cool and all hyped up in his car, revving it, and I'm like, yeah, right, oh, that blew him away. <laughs> yeah, this bike is mental, hey, it's, it's doing the K&N and the secondary, it's, made, it's just brought it alive. Not that it wasn't fast before, but, oh my god, like, it's amazing. Uh, what was I talking about? 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 Uh, b -b 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 oh yeah, my bike. It's mental. Like, I've ridden a lot of 600s and I reckon this, this has to be the quickest 600 I've ever ridden. Like, I know I've only ridden stock bikes and bikes with full pipes, but... I mean, fucking hell, this thing is fucking quick. I don't know, I think it's just the fact that the other bikes I've ridden rather new, or... Um, I know, don't have many Ks as mine. Uh, so my engine is purely bloody run in. And, uh, I think it'll, it'll feel, it feels a lot better than a brand new Jigsaw. Just the fact that it's worn in, it's done the K's and the engine's set. So it's, it's, it's one awesome bike, hey. A lot of people doubt Jigsaw, but it's all about the fun factor, man. Like, you, you, you jump on a bike and you want to have fun, doesn't matter what bloody name or brand fucking model, whatever, 250, 600,000, 1400, doesn't matter what bike it is, as long as you have fun on it, it's what counts. For me, I reckon every bike is cool, like, I'll ride anything under the sun, but uh, yeah, my Jigsaw is absolutely phenomenal. Like, I gotta keep checking my speed, you know when you've been riding for a bit, um, some of the guys that ride every day or got used to riding every day kind of thing. Um, and you kind of know, you, you feel like you're doing a 60. Um, and you look down, you're doing 60 those moments. Um, even 70 and 100, you, you know the feel of the bike, you know the speed of the things going past you, you kind of 
determined pretty closely that you're doing the same speed that the attacker is reading. Um, yeah, so what it is now, I feel like I'm doing 60, but I look down, I'm doing 70. Feels like I'm doing 70, it looks like, and I'm, no, it feels like I'm doing 70 and doing 90. Um, yeah, it's kind of like that. So, it's really a bike that shouldn't really be on, be on the road. But then again, it's fun as fuck, man. Like, it's mental, it's so awesome, though. Like, I know you got blokes out there with leader bikes and uh, 636s and everything with the more torque but the 600 super sport is absolutely brilliant for whatever you want it to do one day i will probably get a leader bike but uh probably not until i can f fulfill my capabilities on this one i think that's i think that, that'll be my plan but like i've ridden leader bikes and it's they're so much fun but like I say, every bike's fun, man. It's it's and whether you whether you enjoy it or not, or you feel comfortable on it. I guess I hear the people that buy our ones as their first big bike. <laughs> oh, it's so stupid. I know some riders are sensible, but most riders coming off their P's aren't sensible. Like I think I'm against myself when I bought this bike. Like until I could control the power around the city. I was kind of scared of it <laughs> and then I could control it and know what it does and know how it reacts and get used to the bike then I felt confident in doing whatever the fuck I wanted on it and I think that's where you've always got to look out as well being overconfident on the bike I think you have more of a chance more of a I think you're higher risk eh? Hey? But I think it's, I think it is part of the riding factor though. If you feel, feel too confident in the bike, I think it's bad for your ride style. You just kind of feel like you can do anything and that's when you get into trouble, but I don't know. I think when you feel comfortable with the bike and you know, or you have experience on the bike for a while, I think you know what to do in cases like that, so. You got like target fixation and all the little things that can cause risk. To your ride but like I said experience on the bike you really um, adjust how you ride when I started riding it became uh, reality real fast that I wasn't the biggest thing on the road didn't get right away and stuff like that but you soon adjust to how the road uses view you on the road but yeah, it all comes down to how you react on the road and how you um, how you react to the stuff that goes on on the road too. Anyway, you know, guys, I'm going to continue on to work. I'll uh, see you in the next vlog. Keep an eye out for my um, my video for our weekend ride. Have fun, guys. See you.